Hey everyone, this is Teddy and I hope you're all doing well today. I'm going to share some more scrapbook layouts with you. Um, layout that I made about a while ago that I haven't had a chance again to show you here on YouTube. But before we get started, I just want to say thank you so much for the sweet comments that you left me here on YouTube and also for the new subscribers that subscribe to my channel just want to give you a shout out thank you and I hope you enjoy my video and I really really appreciate everything so okay let's get started the first layout that I want to show you is this one uh, this layout here this is probably one of my favorite layout that I made uh, for some reason the first reason because um, the bright color and just so colorful I love colors so and the way all the color colors pop up here is just makes me happy anyway um, a little bit about this layout the paper collection that I use is from American Craft older collection Dear Lisi um, and pretty much everything here it's from the same collection I'm not quite sure what it's called but it's like I told you older collection from uh, Dear Lisi okay second part why I love this layout um, for the first time ever I used Rapon on this layout um, I wasn't a big fan of wrap-ons but when I give it a try for the first time on this layout it turned out really good I just love wraps on now <laughs> so yep let me show you the wraps on that I use is this one here the f um, there are two the first one is from basic gray from offbeat collection there are five sheet on this uh, package I got this from a uh, big lot really really cute um, images there and then the second one it's from this collection you really see again it's just I love this collection because it's just so cute and so springy <laughs> so colorful so those are the wraps on that I use and then the circle here this one and that one and that one are a layer embellishment those are felt that comes um, like this I'm not quite sure what they call but this um, all felt like a yeah, layer embellishment and then the f I, I also use the flare from the same collection on this yep. and then the third reason why I love this layout is probably because my kids um, if you can see those pictures both of my kids I don't know why they just happen holding hands walking around the house so I think that's just so cute and I also added journaling there and then I added the uh, clothes pins that I get from Michaels here from their dollar bins so that's about that layout and then let me show you another layout This is not a layout that I made a while ago. And then um, another uh, one of my favorite again because um, as you can see it's just colorful and bright. It's just me. I love colors. So anyway, um, again those are my kids. Uh, we went to an uh, ice cream place called Cherry on Top and they just loved it so I better scrapbook it anyway uh, paper collection that I use on this one uh, my mind's eye lime twist um, I'm not sure what it's called exactly but it's from the lime twist uh, line and then uh, let me think what should I do okay um, the ice cream here this is a stamp images that I use from uh, let me show you the stamp it's from stamp of life uh, hang on one second it's this one here it's the stamp of life by Stephanie Bernard um, if you use stamp club then probably this is really cool I love this stamp 
they do a stamp club like monthly club so you probably should check it out and it's pretty good price for like ten dollars and then look at that stamp pretty big too i love that sentiment ice cream makes everything better so yeah that's the ice cream that's this one and also i use a smaller one on the top over there and then um on this bottom here it's uh, another stamp that i use from uh, sbn company those spanner let me show you is this one here pretty pendants basically what i did just uh paper piece piercing so i stamp it on the pattern paper and then cut it and then i use my uh, close to my heart alphabet stem over there and then this is also stem images the words there from michael's if you remember michael have those uh, a b uh, the alphabet small alphabet stem in their dollar bins for a dollar so that's what i use and that's about it and then i i splash some uh what do you call that glimmer mist so I'll make it kind of messy and fun so that's the second layout and then the third layout I have is this one and another uh, spring summer layout bright colorful layout and the collection that I use for this layout is from Echo Park older collection again called sweet summertime and pretty much whatever I use on this one it's from the collection journaling borders and then um, I added some dimensional a lot of dimensional on this layout the bracket the flower even the board borders so anyway um, and then on the side here I added some uh, paint so yeah if you notice I love to play with paints um, stamp and then yeah miss kind of give it more fun feeling and that's about the this layout um the alphabet here it's cosmo cricket and the bottom one here it's a foam thicker from american craft and that's yeah that's that's about it for my third layout and then the last layout that i'm going to show you today is this one here uh not a favorite layout to uh look at this kid <laughs> sometimes they can be so silly sometimes they just fight with each other so anyway uh the paper collection that i use on this one it's from my mind's eye and this one it's gonna be alphabet soup the boys collection and again this is older collection uh, a simple one I guess everything here yeah the papers from my mind's eye let me I don't know if you can see this this one here the coupon it's a stem images and I love that one uh, it's from this stem that I got it a while ago from Michaels I forgot I had it and then after I've done with the layout I dig through my stash and I found this so I added this the last time so it's just it matches and I love it and then this is a uh, chipboard flower from my stash this one it's uh, my mind's eye too I forgot what collection I just found it in my stash and then um, I don't know if you can see this butterfly it's actually a metal butterfly uh, that I bought a while ago from Michael it's supposed to be like a garden thingy but I just bought it and it's really cool that one and I use some uh, dew drops on that side and then I titled this forever yours and then I made this flowers so yeah that's about it um, that's all my layout hope you enjoy it um, I should be back pretty soon share you some more layout and that's all well, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoy it and I will see you all soon. Thank you. Bye.